Yik Shemesh. Ooh, Yakasha, Wog One. I've been watching too much for, uh... Yo, seriously. Yo. Yeah, I'm gonna start taking the camera with me a lot of places. I'm about to get real gutsy in life. What is that, a freaking mosquito bite? Those darn mosquitoes are killing me, boy. Yo, check it. Alright, yo, wash. Yo, I need to find myself. I need a new tank top. Whoa, black. Yo. Yo, yo, yo. Whoa. I'll pass me the remote. Cool story, babe. Now pass me the remote. I don't like that. Something. Born to win. I like that. It's in small. Okay, blur diary here. I gotta find. I need. I need something new. Swag. All day. Is that me? Actually, actually, man. I don't, how much are these? Four ninety-seven. Whoa, yo. I gotta buy some of these. How much money I got on me? Oh man, I can only afford one. <laughs> I need to become a millionaire now. I need to. Give me one good one, then I'll do the diary. Why are you hating on me? I don't like the colors of that. I think I'm gonna go for this swag one, you know? Whoa, these are all, yo. Five bucks. Yo, these are freaking hot, man. You can't lose with this, man. I need money now. I need to be a millionaire. Right now. Okay, I got mine. All right, yo. I'm going to buy this swag all day, baby. Be doing some documentaries. Okay. So, yo. I know I got to stop saying, yo, like I'm a rapper or some stuff, right? I don't stand the chance. I'll never. I'll never. Nothing's gonna happen. Nothing's gonna happen with me. I got no shot at any type of uh, success or anything. Nothing's gonna happen. Alright, so yeah, I'm trying to get a little away from people here. Okay. I'm on fire today. I'm gonna keep calm, cool, and collective though. What's going on? I went to the fam today for my cousin's graduation. Little would anyone be able to tell. I was a little withdrawn. Talkative myself. I was waiting to do the punchline. I had a really rough, you know, like I've had a rough day. I've had a really rough 15 years. You know, like the punchline. Or I was waiting for like a, a doubt or to, like, Someone did, someone did say something doubtful, but it was like I was waiting. I've been waiting for someone to say something doubtful for me in a crowd so I can be like, because I always have my wooden cross, and I'd be like, ah, you're a doubter. You know? Does anyone, quick, does anyone have a wooden crucifix? Anybody, quick, a wooden crucifix. A wooden crucifix. And then check my pockets. Wait, hold on a second. I have one. I bet I don't have it on me. But what I'm saying is, last night, like, some weird, I went through some weird, I gotta get out of this, is the girls section. Uh, that's like, that's just weird. Can't be walking in that section like that. But yo, check it out, people laughing at me, everything. I don't care anymore, I'm unleashed, do you get it? Do you understand, man? I'm unleashed. Okay, I do have to get cat food, actually. I can't forget that. Mom's cat food. Yo, so listen. Last night, I felt the connection, a serenity with God. I'm ready for season two. I'm ready for... Oh, sorry there. Okay. I'm ready for first album, season two, Searching for God. What I'm saying is, you can't get over losing your soulmate. Tomorrow is a year since I lost her. Dropped her off, my love. I dropped her off at the airport. 
And it was weird when she said goodbye. And she's like, I love you, Ray. Like, that's not my name. My name's Phil. And then it's like, the look on her face was like, you know, like, I couldn't wait. She couldn't wait to get out of here. Like, she never thinks she's never going to see me again. Like, I didn't know that stuff. I was too late. I, lo I messed up. I was too late. I lost my soul for 13 years, then my soulmate. So tomorrow would mark a year. July 1st, 2013 will mark a year since I lost my soulmate, right? What I'm saying is, I feel strong. After everything I've been through, the 15 years, I feel strong. I'm ready to take things to the next level and fully embrace God and fully accept my fate. Everything that I can't be a normal human at all, barely human. That's what it's all about. That's what I'm saying. That's what this Blair Diary is about right now. <sighs> I'm going to fight with everything I got. I'm going to take whatever life throws at me. And I'm going to handle it. I'm going to handle my stuff. I'm going to make all the right decisions. No mistakes. I'm stressed. I'm going to meditate and pray. Whatever happens. So stick around. If I make it through this document, everything till I succeed... You will see a new site, a new YouTube, and a new blog. Professional Redemption Millionaire. Millionaire Blur Club. Peace.